What's going on collective for the weekend? If it's not your story, it may not be for you. What's going on collective uh -huh. for the weekend? Uh -huh. And if it's not your story, it may not be for you, for you. What's going on collective? Hey collective, it's La Mama Little Mama. This is gonna be messages for all signs collectively for the weekend. Something real quick. And y'all know the deal. And uh, if this is not your story, it may not be for you. So, over our messages for the weekend. Your wisdom, your intuition, love life, and something about mm, twists and turns, if that makes sense. Okay. So I'm about to get into this. It's like collective. Yeah, I know we go through these changes right in life, right? Cycles is over and you want new ones, right? And it's like, I know you transmit a lot of energy dealing with anybody that may be a motherfucking energy vampire. You're like, nah. You know some shit, right? And it's like, you walking away from the situation and you change some things up with the focus on your life, right? It's like, do you hear somebody saying that they want you, not need you? Mm. You know something, right? But it's like, collective, you're not trying to deal with somebody who's trying to control the situation because you're highly intuitive and you know. I don't know if you told somebody, listen, they need to put more effort into the relationship and uh, you know you'll definitely be shown the way. It's like you're saying, show you what you need to see, right? And it's like, you taking care of yourself, right? And observing certain things and coming free from a loving heart, right? You know you your own pulse, right? Why? Because you self-love yourself, right? And it's like, as I said before, you still may have somebody in your energy talking about you want to put more effort into the relationship and <laughs> they want you, not need you, right? But some of y'all just may be thinking about your coin, thinking about your money. I'm just saying. Embracing your spiritual growth, your spirituality, right? But why does it always seem like it's a never-ending story? <laughs> if you only knew, right? <laughs> I feel you on that, right? And it's like, are you going to say to somebody, <laughs> or you saying, don't talk to anyone, don't look at anyone. Mm. You need some fucking time alone, and you know why. Mm. If you only know, right? But it's like, you being creative using your imagination, networking, could be working this weekend. You're going to receive some kind of an announcement. I don't know if you heard a lot of ringing in your ears or noises. Could be your cell phone, some kind of messages, right? It's like, because you know the fact that once that healing begins, then there's nothing wrong with being single. You're no longer isolated. You're no longer sad. Because mind you, you transmitted that shit, right? And it's like, you're making these decisions for yourself. But you always still have somebody who's trying to figure out what the fuck you're doing. Like I said, I don't know if it's this energy vampire, but you don't told somebody what the motherfucking change. And you damn sure told somebody you mind your motherfucking business, right? As you should, because you moving forward, right? Standing on what you believe in. Hmm. They may not want to let you go, <clears throat> but however, it's like you're very alert about the situation. But you still may have somebody that's trying to communicate with you. Hmm. Talking about they trying to take your hand. I don't know. Talking about they want some forgiveness from you, right? Mm -hmm. Will you reconcile? Is this what this one's saying? Are you saying, listen, my Fletcher, just be transparent, right? Because you damn sure ain't trying to shake the table and uh, you damn sure ain't trying to have somebody tell you all these goddamn stories all the time, right? Storytellers, if that makes sense, right? Because you got this balance back in your life and you know you're protected, right? But are you going to tell somebody, listen, if you're going to have this deep discussion, keep it 100, right? Because you don't want to feel like you're between worlds, huh? <laughs> You're here and then you're not here. 
but it feels good to release yourself from some bullshit, right? And maybe somebody knows because of the fact that someone is leaving your life, but you good because huh, when you see the different colors, could be different chakras, could be different orbs, whatever. The most difficult part of a situation is over. Hmm, why? Because you're making better choices. Better fucking choices. <laughs> and if you, or whoever you're dealing with, is pissed off at where you are, then stop taking yourself there. Hmm. Sound about forgiveness, huh? Just saying. The collective. You could be out in the community, chilling, but you're going to observe something, right? I mean, you could be working hard if you're working over the weekend, getting the extra money. Do you, Right? But like I said, somebody's always trying to observe the situation or what you're doing. And it's like, I don't know if there's somebody new in your life. Mm. Is it a soulmate? I don't know. After that ending of a chapter, you're highly aware. But like I said, you're building, right? Masculines and feminines, right? Hmm. Holding that coin, right? Being grounded and stable. But you could just be working hard. Focusing on you. And I don't know if somebody is trying to communicate with you. Talking about they still want some forgiveness. Are you going to be light about the situation? Are you going to laugh it off? I don't know. But whoever is gossiping about a situation. Especially if somebody wants to try to come back and reconcile. Want to put that work in and see what they want to invest with you. Is somebody saying it's hard to talk to you? Well, you saying you don't give a fuck no more. Mm. Twists and turns, right? But stop texting. <laughs> stop checking on that person. Just fucking stop. Mm. Spend your time on someone worth it. Don't waste it on ridiculousness. If that makes sense, collective. Overall message. Surrender your beliefs and scarcity. The universe is asking you to open to the infinite nature of abundance. In this way, you can remove blocks in your life and succeed beyond your wildest dreams. Mm. So that's what I got for you.